we are facing a global emergency, the excessive use of black box artificial intelligence. Most of the AI today is based on deep neural networks, okay? These algorithms often have thousands of parameters, which makes them very high performing, yes, but extremely complex to understand. In other words, we don't know what is going on inside a trained neural network. I have been working on this problem for several years now, and I believe this is the biggest challenge we have in AI today. For example, imagine a hospital that is using a neural network to estimate the amount of oxygen needed for a patient in an intensive care unit. What if the output of the AI is wrong? We have no clue of what was the train of thought of the algorithm to choose that amount of oxygen. You see where I'm going? Another example, the CEO of a company is taking a decision based on a recommendation of a black box AI. The CEO might not know why the AI says to do that, but because this system is often right, the company ends up doing it. And here we go. If we don't understand the logic behind, who's really taking that decision? The human or the machine? If there's no supervision possible, I would say the machine is deciding what the company does. Kind of alarming, right? Well, there's a solution. It's called explainable artificial intelligence. And it's a field of AI that advocates for transparent algorithms whose reasoning can be understood by humans. The opposite of what black box models do. So in the oxygen estimation problem that I was telling you about, if we were using explainable AI, it would not only tell us the amount of oxygen needed for the patient, but also what were the reasons that triggered this result. And that is essential. But guess what? The AI that everybody's using now doesn't have this explainability. And why are people not using explainable AI if it is so much more valuable? Well, there are three main reasons. The first one is size. Most of the companies today have huge AI pipelines that are so deeply rooted in their businesses that it would take years to change them. Second one is unawareness. Neural networks are often too famous to explore other alternatives. And finally, the one I like the most, complexity. It is not an easy mathematical problem to obtain this explainability. There's not yet a standard method. In fact, the field of explainable AI has barely started. I want to take this chance to tell the developers, companies, and researchers out there that are listening to start using explainable AI, because really this is the only way we can fully trust, supervise, validate, and even regulate artificial intelligence. And talking about regulation, some of you might be familiar with the GDPR, the General Data Protection Regulation. It requires companies that are processing human data to explain the reasoning process to the end user. Every month now, we see millionaire losses in fines because of the GDPR, but still nothing changes. We keep using black box AI. I want to make a call to action. If you're a consumer, you could demand that the AI used with your data is explained to you. Because if we don't adopt explainable AI urgently, this is the world that I envision. No supervision would be possible. We would be blindly following AI outputs, which will lead to sad and dramatic failures, accepting some of these failures as non-failures, and eventually loss of trust in the human and mystification of the AI, which to me it means that AI is entirely controlling humanity as opposed to humans controlling AI. So it's clear that we need to adopt explainable AI, right? But how? There are two approaches. A bottom-up approach, which requires developing new algorithms that replace neural networks, and sometimes it takes a whole PhD, like in my case, for example, and then a top-down approach, which means modifying the existing algorithms to improve their transparency. To me, this is something worth working on. And over the last years, I came up with a top-down architecture that I believe can help understand the behavior of neural networks. This algorithm, which I call the explainets, aims to generate natural language explanations of neural networks. And for this purpose, it uses the mathematical tools of fuzzy logic to study the network model, learn from it, and then tell us what is the reasoning process it follows. Explain this is really just an example, okay? But in my opinion, it is precisely these human comprehensible linguistic explanations of neural networks what will pave the way towards explainable AI. Thank you.